right, so welcome everyone to episode seven of the Quarantine After Show with me, Corey Stewart. Uh, you know my co-gooder, Kisos, who joins me on each and every episode. And I'd also like to welcome <laughs> the bombastic, bodacious, blissful Ford Ooh. Florida songbird, Billy Mick. Please follow Hi. him on social media. Kisos, if you can throw that command in, I would be yes. eternally grateful. How are you, Billy? I'm fantastic. I'm great. Good. You know, just hanging out. I'm a little. I'm a little hungover today. We had, we actually had um, friends, our our bubble people come over last night. Like people within our bubble that are all also safe. Oh, I thought you meant like champagne, like service or something. I was like, oh. <laughs> no, but gosh, we drank everything. Good for you. You need to have those times every once in a while during this wild quarantine or quarantine situation that we're all in. How is it in Florida yes. right now? I'm interested to know because I've watched a lot of news coverage about Florida. The news makes it seem scary. Yeah. What a shit show. Really? What a shit show. <laughs> Florida's just, I, I'm from Florida. Florida's always been a mess. We, we just are. It's terrible. <laughs> we're, in, we're in Orlando. Orlando is really good. Or, yeah. Orlando is, mm. is really great, but it's... It's just a shame. And it's all about it's all about politics and money. Totally. Well, I know Surprise. that I mean, um, in the beginning of all of this, at the beginning of March, my parents were actually there because they stayed there during the winters they, because Canada is a nightmare to stay in during the winter. Um, and right. they had a place until like the end of, I want to say April or May, and they ended up driving back in March because they were just like, people are fucking around here so wildly, like no one's respecting it. We are so scared for our lives. So they just took off and left. But you know, it is what it is. You gotta be responsible. And it sounds like you're treating it just like we are, where we're kind of staying at home and keeping those bubbles tight and doing what we can do. Ooh. I'm always keeping my bubble tight. Well, baby. so <laughs> your bubble has gotten progressively looser over quarantine, which is interesting. It's uh, true. <laughs> I've um, been sharding a lot. Cheers. Well, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. <laughs> Cheers Look to that. At, he's got to be on his cup for Christ's sake. Things are oh looking up for all of us. Okay, so <laughs> <laughs> Billy, we saw your scars yes. video a few weeks back. Um, you have a lot yes. of music videos. Like you churn them out, and they're always such great quality. Um, what is the process of making your music videos? Like, is there a certain way that you go about putting them together? I my husband films all of them. Wow! And then we um, we have somebody that we've worked with at Universal for years and years and years. Chad Rauchy. He's a brilliant editor. And we send over the stuff and he puts it together and we give him notes back. And we usually, most of our videos are done within like three days. Oh my God. That's amazing. That's amazing. Though you have built done, in done, help. Done. Is that why yes. you got married? Just because you needed someone to film your videos? <laughs> An assistant? <laughs> no, these are things he's actually picked up along the way. He's, he's really great at like the, being a man. He was a manager at Universal for a really long time, but oh, wow. we worked together on uh, a lot of different entertainment projects and stuff like that so he's he's really liking the the video directing thing it's working, it's working you, out really well you work at i feel Universal. like that's a good project to have like during quarantine together you know like something to do it's great we're actually filming another one next week i have a oh, new wow. song coming out on the 23rd well we'll get to that i want to talk more about that but i want to know yes. um you guys met at universal is that right because you work there as well correct we actually we didn't meet at universal oh, we wow. worked we worked at universal at the same time uh and then uh there were layoffs that well i i left universal okay and then we ended up meeting like years later and going back to universal and oh <laughs> and, mm. and working, going back and working there again you just can't get so, enough yeah we I can't quit you, yeah. as the boys say. No, Brokeback. It's, a, it's a good company. It's a good company. Okay, good. We, we like the company, yeah. Nice. So because you work together, how are the dynamics there? Like, are you an absolute diva, bridezilla type energy when you're making your videos? <laughs> or is it like, oh, what's the deal there? No, we, from working in theme parks for so long, uh, especially in entertainment, we are so focused on um, what needs to be accomplished. Like... Sometimes I have to get out of that head and uh, out of that mindset and go, okay, you're, you need to perform now. You, you need to not think about the logistics of how this is going to happen. But we are, when we're together, it is business. Shit's got to get done. Okay. <laughs> it's 
a tight agenda, gonna, and Billy's running it. I was gonna it. say really quick before you move on, Corey. <laughs> yeah. Um, like Billy, I had never really like talked to you, but just seeing your videos, and it's such like, you know, I said Rockstar before, and kind of as a joke, but not really, because I just <laughs> feel like it has like you have like such great performance stage presence and i feel like you're a rock star and it's even more interesting just talking to you you know plain clothes because <laughs> i feel like you're such a calm person and you know just seem <laughs> very laid back so yeah i, I guess i'm just yeah. mesmerized by you like tapping into that <laughs> and really like putting it on you know because not a lot of people can do that and make it so convincing um, it, it wasn't, that wasn't easy for me because I didn't, um, I performed in theaters and theme parks for the last, mm. you know, 30 years. Um, and so the first time that I ever went out on stage, I went out, I, I was singing just me and I had my dancers and in my head, I was like, you know what? I don't need to learn the steps. I'm, I'm Cher. I, I'm going to stand there. I'm going <laughs> to sing my song. Y'all are going to dance. And I walked out on stage and I was like, well, shit, I don't know what the hell I do on stage. I mean, I've just, mm. I've not done this before. So yeah. it took a couple of times before I was like, okay, I, I feel good about this. And quarantine's been fabulous for it because I've gotten to do all these virtual prides um, over in London, up in Canada. Um, so I've been able to do a lot more of that performing and I feel much more comfortable doing it just by myself, which is great. I think yeah. it's also like I've learned um, from doing the performing as well. Like I, I have similar background to you where I've done sort of theater and that thing sort of thing as well. Um, when it comes to doing your own songs, you kind of have to put a little thought into how you're going to present on stage where you're gonna go. I mean, I don't do choreography whatsoever because I have two left feet and <laughs> it's just always a nightmare. But it's important to know where you're gonna go on the stage. Otherwise, you can look kind of discombobulated and you don't look confident. That's me. And you do, you have to map it out. And Kiso says it's rehearsing. It's rehearsing at home, as silly as it is. That's all you need yep. to do. Now, Billy, were you ever an impersonator at any of these? Uh, like, did you ever do any impersonations? Because I feel like you'd be... Uh, no, okay, so I'm just going here and, uh, and oh, there's no uh, result. Do it, please. Okay, well, I was just wondering, like, a Ricky Martin impersonator or something like that. Like, I could see that from <laughs> you, like, at the theme park. Uh, no, Even I, Elvis. No, Elvis would work, oh, too. Oh, I'm in, I'm in. I No, I never did that. Okay. I was, uh, I did the Beetlejuice show for uh, a oh, long sweet. time. I was... I was a wolf man, and then I was uh, contracted as a Dracula for a while. Oh, I can um, see Dracula. Very that vampire was fun. energy. I, I, <laughs> I, got to sing, I got to sing You Took Me All Night Long every day. So oh, it was, I was like, yes, I'm in. I'm in. It's all me. <laughs> Speaking of music, yours is always so uplifting and happy, which I'm somewhat jealous of because I can't write music unless it's about something miserable. <laughs> so what yeah. is, like, what is it that brings that out of you like are you just genuine genuinely a happy person or what is it that yes. kind of strike yeah is that all right well that's nice for you well, <laughs> i mean the, well, the thing... you lucky. <laughs> <laughs> well the thing is i think with um with any kind of bad things that happen i always just have to look at it and go okay what is what am i walking away from this with i'm walking away from this with something and that's why this is happening you can't right. wallow in it oh my god are you kidding i'd be like curled up in a ball right now during quarantine right well i mean yeah, billy you know. we don't need to see, start talking about me right now but let's uh move on <laughs> <laughs> <Let's>... <laughs> all right um so you were saying you have a single coming up soon um tell yes. us about it and give us a date if you can i mean i don't want to pressure you but i kind of do so give us that's the okay details. Uh, october 23rd <laughs> it's coming out so okay. we, we awesome we set we set the date and um we're gonna start filming the video next week and i'm really I, i'm really excited about it actually we have all of these street art um, artists in Orlando, and we have all these walls that have all these different street art on it. Oh, cool. So I'm gonna, mm. uh, keeping socially distant, mm. I'm actually going to utilize all of those walls and of course credit the artists and have their contact info and, and whatever. Um, but I just thought that would be just a really cool back backdrop yeah. for that. And then I'm just gonna wear all black and white so not to distract from the art and let that be its thing. That's such a so, cool idea cool. and a great way to give other people the spotlight as well in terms of, Absolutely. you know, making other artists known within 
art itself. It's a really smart idea. I love it. Yeah. And I, I'm excited. I have I know this really, really awesome, badass chick guitarist, and she's going to play guitar in the video. Because um, mm. of course, I don't ever I, I don't ever have actual real instruments in any of my songs. They're Same. all just. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm, I'm dying to have a band. That would be so fabulous. That would be great. <laughs> awesome. That's so cool. Um, well, everyone look out for that. Is the video dropping the same day, October 23rd? Or is it the single yes. for... Yeah. Wow. A yeah. Double whammy. Everyone Here we keep go. your eyes peeled. Next I month, think everyone. The link keeps <laughs> popping up in the chat, so make sure you're looking for it and you're following Delia on social media as well as his yeah. Spotify so that you don't miss it when it comes. All right. Yeah. Now it is time for a game. Since Billy works at Universal Studios, we have a game called Universal Studios or Universally Unlikely. Here's how oh. it works. <laughs> <laughs> I will say the name of a potential attraction that is either made up or a real Universal Studios attraction. Kisos will have five seconds, which Billy will count down, to guess whether it is actually a, universally, a Universal Studios attraction or Universally Unlikely. Billy okay. will then tell us the real answer after Kisos says yes or no. Um, if Kisos okay. gets it wrong, we have to do five squats. If Kisos okay. gets it right, I will personally donate, a, um, I guess, like five bucks to Raziz. Is that how you say it? Kisos? Raices. Raices. So I will donate mm -hmm. $5 every time you get a right answer. Ooh. Oh, Af God. After okay. the stream. After the stream. But yes. <sighs> yeah, All that's right. fine. So, You're allowed. The first attraction or universally unlikely attraction is Too Fast, Too Furious, Vindication Time. Five. I'm going to say no. Four. Oh, you got it right. Okay. Uh, <laughs> sorry, Billy has to tell us you got it right. Sorry, Billy. I That's jumped okay. in, but I'm right. That is all right. Just making yeah, a note. on Billy's here. toes. <laughs> I have a tendency to do that no matter where I am, Billy, so I apologize. All is right. there a Fast and Furious ride, though? There or, is. Like, attraction? There is. I was going to say, Vindication is terrible, but it's possible. <laughs> <laughs> I came up with it, so of course it's terrible. All right, the next <laughs> one is Woody Woodpecker's Nuthouse Coaster. Five. <laughs> Sounds kind of hot. I'll say three, yes. Two. Really? Is, there is five. Yes. Yes, and it's actually, it's a kid coaster. It's very fast. Oh, wow. wow. Okay. Little so kids' wigs fun. flying off sometimes. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> sometimes, uh, well, if I ever do have a child, I know where to take them. All right, so yeah, next them. is... <laughs> Just kidding, everyone. Born Assassination. Five. I'm going to say yes again. Three. Wrong. Really? That's not the title. Okay, so we have to do five squats. Okay, let me get my bubble tight. What's the real name? Is, my husband is actually something... opened that show. Did he really? Okay, I'm just gonna... Yeah, he was. He worked with the production company on it. <laughs> Two, three, four. Oh wait, oh you five. already started. Oh yeah, well like, <laughs> we can never go in sync, so it's like why? Okay, I'm Jesus, a little... where did you learn to do squats? All right, so I also realized I didn't start playing game show music and that's what makes this partially fun. So we got to do that. And then we'll get back to Billy's <laughs> scars. Um, okay, the Silence. next one is one fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish. Five. I'm gonna say no. Four. Nope, that's a real one. <laughs> oh my God, such a long name. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna do. Oh, what do we have to do here? What so is that one? To, is it like? We is have it to do like five more squats. Show? It's kind of, it's kind of like a Dumbo ride, but then there and you're in a fit. You're in the fish, like um, Dr. Seuss fish, uh -huh. and then the, the water squirts on you. Oh, oh that sounds yep. right up Keith says yep. Valley. <laughs> I was gonna make a joke, but I also I think I just, just love six. water rides. So. <laughs> Kisos will do anything yeah, only, if he gets squirted on only, or is available. It to only squirt. squirts you. I mean, of course, but you only get squirted on if you don't listen to the directions because it, it like rhymes and tells you when to go up and when to go down. That's what my uncle used to say. Depending on the color of fish you're in. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> that is so funny though. That's actually really cute. Okay. It's cute. Okay, we'll do one more. We'll do one more. Um, okay. <sighs> Shrekified Jurassic World. 
Okay, that's definitely not. <laughs> I Correct. wanted to get one not. more donation in. <laughs> Thank you for giving me one free one. We got others. Yeah, can you imagine if they Shrekified Jurassic Park? Like, and it, everything I was just it. Shrek. I mean, I mean we'll really, it. something for the suggestion box when you get back to work. <laughs> <laughs> I will definitely, I will definitely pop that in there. Perfect. Yeah. I love it when you pop it <laughs> in there. No, I don't want you. <laughs> I don't want you to get fired. <laughs> He's not going to get fired for suggesting Shrek should be happening in Jurassic Park. If anything, it may make Shrek extinct, which would be actually a gift to all of us. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. I love Shrek. Um, all right, so now it's time for everyone's favorite. Say it with me, Kisos. Squirt. Squirt. And, and tell. Tell. All right, we've asked Billy to collect three things that mean so much to him during his quarantine journey, and he is going to walk us through them right now. Yes, yes. First, I have my PS4 controller. Oh, okay, Ooh. you're a gamer. Uh, because what have um, you been playing? Okay, I'm kind of a gamer, right? Like, I do, yes, um, but I play DC Universe Online mostly. Oh, okay. And is it like an it, MMO? Yeah. Yes. Okay. You like create your like hero or villain and you have powers that you can choose. And then you have right. all these fabulous outfits that you can get for them. Right. <laughs> so I have, like, you can I have like 32 characters and like I, I, I'll, some days I'll be like, I want a new character. So like go through and you know, you like send your money to another character and delete that one and start over and <laughs> it's dumb. It's dumb. I feel ya. No, I totally get it. It's like <laughs> basically if anyone doesn't understand, it's like World of Warcraft, but like Yes, yes, yes. And well, I mean, what the hell's better than that? Don't right. the characters on World of Warcraft that. kind of look like Shrek? I'm just asking. Some of them do. Yeah, some but of them this do. is not that. Oh, Billy, I like do. your next item. I'm familiar with it. Vodka. Uh, <laughs> we actually, uh, I was always a big wine drinker until we went into quarantine. I was like, okay, it's entirely too hot to even walk outside. We need something with less sugar in it. Right. Or we're going mm. to be the size of the house by the time we get okay. out of quarantine. That's so we switched to vodka. Reason. Yeah. <laughs> vodka seltzer. And For you know what? Reasons. Pinnacle, surprisingly enough, Pinnacle Vodka uh, is a uh, big supporter of the LGBTQ community, um, at least in Canada. Oh, oh, that's the awesome. charity that I'm Someone on the board of, it. they like sponsored a whole yeah. Pride campaign last year for us and gave us like thousands of dollars. So, I mean, you're on the that's right awesome. track with them. Um, all right, your that's next amazing. item. I can't this see is, it. Can you move it? Okay, there we go. Okay, Billy, what do you is, do with that? This is Tiana's favorite, favorite, oh, okay. favorite toy, my Got little it. Boston. I thought she would come in here. Oh, Tiana. 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 I love a Boston. I'm going to oh, try and move We love Boston. We have, we, have a, um, we have a beagle that we've had since he was uh, tiny, and he's 10 now. And we decided oh. that he needed a friend because we just worked such long hours and stuff like that. So we um, actually got in touch with the Boston Terrier Rescue of Florida and we adopted a senior um, because we didn't mm. want a puppy and we also wanted him to have somebody close to the same age. So right. she's, actually, too. She, she's actually our third um, oh, wow. in, the, in the last couple of years. But we like, we like getting the seniors and they've been fantastic. Oh, and here. Oh, oh look at this is. sweet little face. Mm -hmm. Oh. Hello! Oh, We're getting direct I eye contact Boston right Terrier. now, too. I love, I love, uh, <laughs> and there's the hubby. It's Brian, right? It's my, it's, and and he's my, he would actually be my first item that of I course. have to have during quarantine. Of course. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Brian. Let me stay with you. Thank you, love. Um, thank you for sharing those, Billy. Those are all great. I feel like I identify Absolutely. with the last two the most, so thank you for sharing them. <laughs> uh, <laughs> so it's now time for our final game, which is in honor of Billy's first album, Just Be. We're going to call, okay. we're going to play a game called Just Be. So here's how it works. Billy has provided me with five different objects that start with the letter B. I have to describe them in three words, and Kisos will have to guess what they are within those three words. If we don't get oh, them within God, okay. 10 seconds, which Billy again will be counting us down, we will need to draw that item that was being described on our face with eyeshadow. And yes, okay. eyeshadow is back again this week. Don't at me. All right. So 
I don't even know. I just realized they don't have my my brushes for it because I actually washed them the other day. I was like, I haven't washed these. You can okay. use your finger or. I was gonna use a, <laughs> like I'm a, use a sharpie, nail. but it's probably better for me to not do that. <laughs> it's good to contaminate your. Makeup. Okay, I'm ready. All right, so. The, yeah, yes. I'm going to go on your first one, and this one I think we're gonna get. Just of saying right now. Um, oh God, that's not true. Here's the first okay. three words. Bury. Um, yellow. Uh, paint. Fruit. Banana. Okay, so we got that one. That was an easy one. Okay. Oh wait, I forgot it starts with B. Yeah. So it's like a little bit okay. easier for you, sweetheart. <laughs> right? Remember when I said paint, y'all? Paint. Yeah. <laughs> paint. <laughs> also, bury and paint. Oh, I see. Cause she ate the paint. Got it. All right. So our next one. Yeah, it was like yellow paint. Sweaty. Okay. Uh, circular. Balls. Oh, <laughs> we're good. <laughs> Okay, shit. This. Oh, I was gonna say pussy at first, but I was like, let me let me wait one more. <laughs> this next one is kind of hard. Um, instrument. <laughs> so am I. Ooh, okay. Tantalizing. But soon. Uh, you. Uh, uh, instrument. Um. Drums. Um, Bongo. Yes. Wow. I yes. mean, this might be easier than I thought it was going to be. Okay. <laughs> The next one. Balls. Okay. <laughs> the next one is uh, coronavirus. Uh, vampire. Uh, blood. Fly. Not blood. Buzz? But I feel like we're almost at 10 seconds here. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry. I, no, it's I, okay. That was my cue. <laughs> we Five, lost that one. <laughs> four. <laughs> Billy, do you want to tell him what that one was? That was bat. Yes. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, I got confused because coronavirus was a pangolin and not a bat. I know, but the, there was this remember. common in kids. Oh, whatever. <laughs> All right, now it's time to draw a bat. On oh, us, I think I wouldn't have got it anyway. I would not have. Done <laughs> well, there we go. And I'm using. Wait, what were the three words? It was coronavirus. Uh, um, vampire. Vampire. And what was my last one? My memory is about as good as a bat's. So, um, I can't. <laughs> I don't remember what the last one was. Oh, well. Well, I we can, everyone, if, we'll watch it back on the rerun exactly. out next week. Uh, you mean in like two days. Yeah. All right. So we have to draw a bat yeah, on our days. faces somehow. I don't know how I'm going to do this. Oh, that's right. Okay, cute. Yeah. Oh, fly. My mom said it was fly. Oh, but right. I was Mama like Kiso's fly, always on like the ball. Flying. Okay. Oh, my God. Um, uh, this is so I hard, just realized really? that we had comments. I hope I've not missed anybody. Oh, it's okay, Billy. Today. I just ignore them. Oh the no, whole that's time. okay. <laughs> <laughs> They're used to Tina it. Tina said Wolf has made mac and cheese and cheese toast when she got home. Her son was just cooking. Oh sweet! Oh, that's nice. I want so. mac and cheese and cheese toast. Can Wolf come uh, be my? Personal I know. Did he chef? did he even make enough to share with you, Tina? This is gonna look like one of those like seagulls in the distance. You know when you just draw the bird and it's like a V. <laughs> Oh my god, mine is looking a little worse for the wear. My bat definitely has coronavirus. <laughs> oh, yours is big. What is that? It looks like a rifle. Listen. Although, to be fair, mine just looks like... I can't really see because it's so bright, too. Okay, well... <laughs> I'm that's... like, I don't know where I put the last thing. That's a bat, kids. And, uh... For more of my artwork, check out my Instagram. I'm just gonna smudge something. Oh, yours is cute! Okay, I see it now. It's close. It's close. Mine literally just looks like I got slapped, but that's okay. Well, then that's normal. <laughs> um, all right, so next and final for Billy. Um, oh, okay, let me think for a sec, because I didn't really think this one through. Okay, uh, undergarment. Um, yes. Oh. Bustier. Uh, Bra. Lower. Um, 
boxers. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. I was trying to think of a lower thing, and I was like, "What's down there? What's lower <laughs> undergarment? I don't know if undergarment is two words or think. not, but whatever, you know." So, Billy, you're working on a new I album, one. right? Like, you have a full uh, new album that's coming this year. Is that right? Yes. Holy. Uh, no, it'll not come next year. year. Okay. I'm gonna. I'm gonna still try to kind of follow the same format of like a once a month release right. until, but this album has uh, 13 songs on it. Oh wow, that's incredible! Like the fact that's that you lot. can do all of this work and all of your stuff is such great quality, and you're just churning them out. It's Thank so you. amazing. Thank you. Um, yeah, I'm very excited. I have I already have the next three releases planned um, until January. Um, wow. And then, uh, well, actually, yeah, through January into February. So That's back awesome. in the studio again soon. <laughs> well, everyone keep an eye out for October 23rd. Billy's new song is going to drop. His new video is going to drop. And, and you're video. going to drop. Yes. So without <laughs> further ado, I guess we should all say goodbye. And thank you so much, Billy. Is there anything you want to leave people with before we take off? I just seriously want to say thank you guys so much. I follow you all the time, and I feel like we interact so often, and yeah. this is the first time we've actually spoken. Uh, so this mm -hmm. is really awesome. So thank you yeah. guys very much for having me. I really appreciate it's it. It's nice thank to have you, you on. So much, really, we had a great time with you. It's good to face-to-face -face it. I know. I love it. I can't wait to do it again. Very soon. Very soon. Mm -hmm. Love it. <laughs> okay. Well, we'll see you all next week. Thank you for joining in on the after show. And don't forget to donate. Please and thanks. Bye. Donate. Bye.